Well, fortunately, we've not got as barber jackets and as hunter wellies. Neither have we got a, a designer dog. The first time I went to Scarborough, I went on a I went on a donkey. It took me 12 days. Did you? Think about it. Oh, wow. How good is that box? It's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. First thing I've done is priced up the drinks. Oh, they are pricey. Yeah, like seven quid a pint, seven pounds, seven pounds fifty a pint. Brian splitting, cracking, making the level soft and soft. Hey, I hope you do both of them. Yeah, I'll do that. <laughs> <laughs> no, we've got to buy some so yeah, I can do it other. So, if, you are, if you are interested, they're £15 a pot. Okay. But Just the one pot's going to last you five to seven years. Oh, wow. yeah, that's only I was feeling the pressure sales come on there. Yeah. But uh, I, I'd just shut him down. No, he was a nice no, lad. No, he wasn't. Nice uh, they, they were. No, they, they were. It's good stuff. It does look good, so, and, yeah. no, and I was saying I've not cleaned them. Yeah. So you got your shoes. Cleaned for free. Fifteen quid a tub, though. I've seen a lot of mullets and mullets? hats with feathers in. Mullets. Yeah, I've seen a few mullets. I don't know if what, that's, that's a country thing. Yeah. But oh, yeah. I've seen I've not uh, hunter wellies, barber coats, and hats with feathers in. Are they called fedoras? I don't know. Yeah, but they'll be a fortune. Yes. <laughs> 99. We'll get the cheap. Uh, I don't know. Thank you very much. It's too small. <laughs> Beer o'clock. Is it beer o'clock? Glass of Pims, £8.50 in there. Wow. I'm just giving prices to everybody because that's what they wanted me to do. You seen the price of it? Those hot beef rolls smell absolutely fantastic. They do. They're £9.50 each. <laughs> so we'll give them a miss. I've just heard on the tannoy that there's going to be some sort of parachute jump, I think. I don't know. So we might hang about here. It's a bit warm, isn't it, Rob? Yeah, it's a warm and it always makes a difference. The volunteers from a wide range of backgrounds who generously give their time to help at the country fair before, during and after the event. Cheers. Not so. How much was that, Helen? Seven English pounds. We've only done that for you guys. It's not even that good. But we're doing this so you can see the price, what you could be paying. <laughs> we'll yeah, come. look, we're just helping. It's like public service. It's a public service, this. <laughs> and we'll do Rotherham Show tomorrow and we'll see the difference in prices. Yeah. Okay. Strawberry cider and another what one. What is the difference between cider and perry? Pear. Pear apples. All right. Oh, do you know? I'll have a perry then, please. Cheers. Cheers. We're on the cider now. It's too sweet for me, this. I've got a strawberry. And I've got, I've got cider. Yeah, we've both got cider. Is yours physical? It's more of a flat, well, some cider is flat, Mine isn't it? is flat. The thing, 
that, do you know when you get to, when I tasted that other one, it was horrible. Yeah, I think why we've done that <coughs> is because it was only 4 50 a pint, whereas all pound. other big, what were it, five quid? Five quid a pint, whereas all others were like 7 50 so we just felt obliged. Because it was technically, it was like a bargain, but it's well, te technically we not a bargain. Well, we just wanted to work, and it you know, was small, support, yeah. you know, like an independent business. Mm. And if it involves alcohol, we'll always support them. We shall. Yeah. That's how you do a country fair, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and we've got food yet. We've got Have you got food as well? Not here, in the motor, but it's too much. We ain't fucked that. We need another trolley. Um, you need a convoy of trolleys. <laughs> You're giving us inspiration for next time. <laughs> wow. Respect, so, absolute respect. I am going to find myself yeah. the prettiest woman around here and she's going to look like one of them cows or one of them sheep. <laughs> I'm going to get my wellettings out. <laughs> that's I mean, I mean, don't get one that's got a red stripe. <laughs> I like that, that's the old, that's the old um, red go, tide, isn't it? Go, the what? That's the call of diesel, isn't it? It looks like it, doesn't yeah, it? That's yeah, that's what they call it, they call it diesel. Oh, I don't know, I'm not a, I'm not a cider, cider drinker myself. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's nice. There's another one like it called uh, Red Diesel. It's very right. strong. Right. See you later. See you, my friend. Day. See you. Thank you. Bye. Yeah, that's how you do at Country Fair. It is. Isn't it? Yeah. Talk, guys. <laughs> So we used to supply all the fancy chefs in Bakewell oh, yeah, yeah. and then during lockdown I just had kilos and kilos of mushrooms and we had to think of a new use for them. We should try some of these for his tea tonight. Yeah, we make them all, we produce all the fruit, yep. It's all 30%. It's amazing that one, yeah. Got 10 international awards as well with it. So there's a massive crowd here. I don't think I'll get anywhere near. I'll have to extend you on the stick. I hope it's like some kind of like synchronized Let's diggers. Synchronized diggers. Do you want to sit on my shoulders? I'm... <laughs> <laughs> right, if you thought you'd got a bad back, then you will if I say Oh, we've missed it. What an incredible display by the world famous JCB Dancing Diggers. That's the story of our life. We've missed another show. Yeah, but I'm not worried about I wanted to see Diggers. I'm a bit... I'm, I'm, no, I'm upset. I wanted to see Do you them. like Diggers? Yeah. I'm in the toilet queue. It's, oh, look at the door! It's like... It's like coming to a festival with a kid. I've just queued for ages to go to the toilets. Then I've come back and I was like, oh, I want to go to the toilet. Well, I'll hold it. If well, no, you go, you go. You do what you want to do. I'm capable of holding it. Right, here's a competition, right? We're going to play a game. You've got to guess which toilet Helen's gone in, right? So here's your options. There you go. Which one's it going to be? So one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty-one toilets. Which is it going to be? Which is the Helen Lou? <laughs> Did you do a number two? No. Alright, we took long enough. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, I was uh, checking my. Uh, I've got a spot I need to cover up. In, uh, <laughs> I'll play I was a checking game. my makeup. I'll play in a game with the audience. Guess the toilet, which is. Ah! Really cool. <laughs> hey, that could be a good game. It's a game. Guess the portaloo. Why did you not know which Port one? Portaloo roulette. <laughs> Porta it is a roulette, honestly. <laughs> Thank you there for the Alan Just Titchmarsh the update. <laughs> <laughs> so he's not in there. The Alan Titchmarsh have not arrived. Little wait. How much is the Alan Titchmarsh? 30 quid. 30 quid for the book. Yeah. But how much would it be worth if you got it signed? 25. <laughs> James, you're funny. Well, let's go down here. What they did, they filled this bit full of steel and heavily onto it. Steel rod through here, so I couldn't chamber around. You would weld it, you just want to cut the bolt from it. You would pop them in that little bit of a slot there. You push all five rounds in. You'd slide the bolt back forward. So they'll drive fire it. Go, slide forward. Mm. Cool. Oh, you've been shot. Hang on. Hang on. It's got to be the yeah, we're in. And there you go. Sort of. So now you're rocked and rolled with five rounds of 792. And this will put someone down out for good. Yeah. <laughs> that was amazing. I remember in the 80s the bread van coming round. Yeah. And, uh, and they used to have the, the pop man. But we were poor. Oh, we're not so going to start that again, are we? We, weren't, we couldn't have the pop man. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, well done, and now, and bad lovely clear round for the final tip. It's our own tip, 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 Oh, look at the little boy. <laughs> He's just giving me a lovely smile. I mean, that's stunning. Sixty-seven. Timothy Oh, well, that's a roller as well. So we just had probably the most expensive food I've ever bought. And it was terrible, it really was. We had uh, hot pork and stuffing sandwich, it was just crap. There was no sort and of chips. effort went in and we had soggy cold chips and a water and that come to 14.50 for that, unbelievable. But as, yeah. we've, as we've walked around, I just said to Helen, there's all these food places, they're all really quiet. Nobody's buying food because it's just so expensive. But they're all having a drink though. People all, people yeah. all have a drink, won't they, before food. We shouldn't have done it. We should, I wish we hadn't bought that, to be honest. I feel a bit angry at myself. Yeah, we shouldn't, I, I could have like, I'm not starving to death. I could we have We should have waited, waited and just gone and... I'd have pub lunch somewhere. Yeah. So I'm mad at myself. But I just wanted to, I don't know, I wanted to show people what an idiot I am. I can see you moving around. So, it's time for an honest, if that manager up in background. It's time for an honest verdict, and we've not we've not consulted at all. An honest assessment. But we're going to do an honest assessment. Just off the cuff, we Just haven't talked cuff. about it. These are our true feelings about the day. Yeah. Well, it's ridiculously expensive to get in. Oh yeah. Twenty-eight pound fifty <gasps> each to get wow. in. Wow. And the ent honest opinion, I wanted to hate it. 
there's lots to look at and there's lots to see, lots of shows and things. We did miss a lot of them, didn't we? Yeah, I think you need to spend an extra three pound and buy a programme, which we didn't. Because there were a lot of things happening in the main arena, but we weren't really aware. And, and we just saw the things when we were walking past, didn't we? Yeah, so we did, we did miss a lot of it, but we still enjoyed walking around and talking to people. It's a nice, chilled vibe, isn't it? Yeah. It's, it's been lovely and sunny Lots today. of different types of people from all walks of life. And I think next time, if I came again, I'd be more prepared. I'd have seats to sit in, you know, you can get those picnic chairs. I'd bring them, I'd bring a pat lunch, I'd bring my own booze. <laughs> that is the big thing. That is the main crux of it here. The food and drink is extortionate. It is, it's, it's not just expensive, expensive it's extortionate. Yeah. So, yeah, a pint, £7.50 for crap beer. It's not even decent beer, like Carlsberg and stuff like that. We did find the place with the cider, which but the cider was not good. But we're not cider fans, no. really. But that were a fiver each, which were a bit cheaper. Yeah. But that food was shockingly bad. It was not good. I, c I can make that. I food, mean, fourteen pound fifty is depressing. What I paid for that. Yeah. And we noticed walking around, there's all these seating areas. There's hardly anybody eating. It's people eating their own food, their own sandwiches, mm. but not they're not paying them prices. Once you've paid all that money to get in, it's it's just a dear do. If you come as a family of four, you're going to need a couple hundred quid, aren't you? Yeah. For kids' rides and stuff like that. There is a lot to do, but a lot of the things you have to pay for extra. So our tip would be, if you're going to come here... Bring cash. Bring cash. Because there wasn't many um, places that took cards. That, that was an internet issue, I think. It was it. Uh, bring your own booze and bring sandwiches. Yeah. So. And bring a chair. And a picnic blanket. Make a lovely day of it. Yeah. Just watch everything. Buy a programme for three quid. Okay. That's our verdict on the Chats with Country Fair. Well, guys, it's another day and it's another show. So today... Day in the life of By the we're Curb. We're living dream. Oh, <laughs> two shows in two days. But this is a co uh, quite a different affair. Uh, sorry, I didn't get you on the screen. We're walking under these trees. It's probably not the best. But we're at Rotherham show today. Looking at all the cars that we've had over the years, you know, like Escorts and Novas. All the cars that we have owned That's over it. the oh, years. Oh, I've had this one as well. There's one we blew flashing lights on. I've been it back in a few of them. <laughs> <laughs> No, that's a joke. So this is a Chrysler Crossfire. Uh, and I was one of the first people in the UK to get this car. Really? Yeah. It was, it was a three and a half litre and it was in red. And it was called Rio. That's what we called it. Absolutely amazing car. Beautiful car. Can you imagine? Very they've got flash. they've got a fin that comes up on I bass. didn't know you when you were flash. I know. It does always give you a bit of a better vibe when you've paid no to get in. It does. <laughs> and you're just wandering off street. Right, do you know that mobility scooter that man, man yeah. was on? It said Parkgate Shopping Centre. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He'll have borrowed it. He's borrowed it for <laughs> yeah, the next few years. So we're actually in Clifton Park and I do come here quite often. If, it, if, you, if it's not too far for you, it's actually a great park to come with kids on a Sunday. Lots for them to do. There's a little like, there's a mini theme park up here. Lots of rides for them and there's a paddling pool they've drained, obviously. Probably to keep all drunks out this weekend. Let's keep riffraff out. <laughs> Back in the day when I was like 16, this was my favourite ride in the fair. I used to love it. It's a big old fair, this, isn't it? I came here a few years ago and I had one of the best pork pies with mushy peas and mint sauce and I'm hoping that they're here today but you never know. Oh there's some sort of show going on here. Shall we watch this? I nearly lose my lunch when it's with snacks Get the way the way I push it To fight that a wolf from underground Be brave and 
so this part that we're in now it looks as if it's some sort of like community hub it's like a circular thing there's some food over there though all but there's all all sort of activities free stuff for kids to do walking through a food bit here and the prices are more or less the same as, as well, Chatsworth some are, a little cheap. some are a little bit cheaper like you've got oh it says from four pound fries and nachos because you can get loaded fries right? yeah. but the Greek wraps down there they were a tenner that were very expensive what you spotted Helen <laughs> are you gonna are you gonna do your walk to the bar where you're like normally ten foot in front? Cheers. Cheers. That were a bit better than Chatsworth, that was five yeah. pound a pound. And the bottle of water was a pound. Yeah, yeah. A pound for bottle of water. And That's a bit better, I've got a black sheep and you've got a Guinness, so it's a bit yeah. better. And the Guinness is on draft. Yeah. It was in a can at Chatsworth. Yeah, so. And it was seven pounds. So now you know. <laughs> along oh, we've got all the vegetables in there we need to go see some uh, massive melons <laughs> <laughs> also huge cucumbers <laughs> and trust me it's going to be cost effective and it's something yeah it's a big you project you it's like to do today after you've been to the London yeah. show mm -hmm. so come join us in the food, free food. There was a chap there, a fellow sweatcloth wearer. Uh, fellow sweatcloth. Oh, yeah. Three different dishes. Oh, yeah. Three different dishes. Oh, yeah. Three different So I have to film. I have to film this bit. You need your own space. I have to film this for my mum. Don't we? Is it just me on this one? Have I lost you? He couldn't look me in the eye while I was doing that. <laughs> Are you, uh, you all okay? I'm going to show you, uh, I'll get a musical instrument now. Let's, 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 let's try this one. Fantastic bit of Yorkshire humour there. I don't know if you heard Helen what, what Helen said, but he got his banjo out, this guy. And he says, uh, do you know what this is? And some kid shouted, rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs>
So there's certainly a lot to see here. There's not a big sort of central arena type thing like there was at Chatsworth. And I think they've had that in the past here. I came years ago and they had that with like army displays and stuff. But uh, there's a lot of smaller like independent little shows. It's very family orientated, isn't it? Yes. I, like, I, I really like it. It is. Absolutely red hot. It is, it's too hot. Yeah, it's, it, it's red hot. The food seems to be the same prices as Chatsworth, but then yeah. you've not paid to get in. The drinks are... That is right. The drinks are cheaper. I tried that German area if there was one. Yeah, I, I, I was saying to Helen that the last time I come here there was like a German area where they all had bratwursts and German beers, which I love. But can't, I don't know if that's here this year, I can't seem to find it. But there was some nice Indian food down here I think we're going to go and try, aren't we? Yes. Honestly, if you could smell that, that is fantastic. Helen! Smell lovely, isn't it? it? Smells nice. Yeah, yeah. How much it? So what we got? I have got. It looks a bit messy. Chicken curry and a naan bread. And I have got two chicken legs with all the dressings on. So everybody tried the best. Oh, Johnny vowed that he would never ever end up like the rest. The set price of electricity is going up, but it's ridiculous, this, isn't it? Yeah. Shall we have a wonder? In this direction. I'm just worried that we might have missed something. It's what something really good. Well, it's have so we big. This bit? It's so big, isn't it? Let's, yeah. I think we did go over that bit. Oh, did we? Did we go over that bit? That's a beauty. Immaculate. <laughs> It's got like a little table or something like that. Yeah. Okay, we're heading back. That's Rotherham <laughs> Shore. And let's do. Hope you liked it. Let's do a verdict and then we'll do a comparison, shall we? Oh, okay. So, are you going first this time? Yes. Go on then. What do you want me to say? What did you think of Rotherham Shore? I really liked it and the reason why was because there was equally enough to do as there was at Chatsworth, but it was free. The only downside, Alan Titchmarsh wasn't there. <laughs> you were a bit upset. He didn't put an appearance in. <laughs> it was very family oriented. It was, yeah. There were a lot more families and kids at this one. I think there was more to do here. It there was, was a different was clientele. More to see. Yeah. But maybe because we didn't know what there was to see at the Chatsworth one because we didn't buy a programme. No, it's a different kettle of fish. Yeah, it like. is. And there but, was no programmes to buy. But if. So next year. If yes. I was going to choose only one, whether I'd go to Chatsworth or go to Rotherham for a day, what would you choose? <laughs> That's a tough one, isn't it? It is. Being it's... a tight ass, I'd choose Rotherham. Would you? Because it just feels good, the fact that you can just wander in and it's free. And Yeah, we I... did see a lot of the, the stands here that were at Chatsworth. Do you know all the different uh, organisations? Yeah. And... 
yeah. You would probably go to charts with them. Probably, you? yeah. Yeah. But that's, you had to think about it. I'm just a big fan of Rotherham Show. Oh, that. No, I've enjoyed the day out. I've enjoyed it. And I, I'm, I'm first to, to knock Rotherham Council. But, uh, yeah, that, the Rotherham Show is good. Yeah. It's, always, it's always good for a day out. Anyways, that's it for this video. Bit of something different for you there. Hope you've enjoyed it. What do you think? What's your what's uh, country fairs and things like in your neck of the woods? What's your favourite show? Which one looked the best to you? Uh, so hope you liked the video and please subscribe if you want more yeah. of this type of it stuff. It doesn't cost please a like penny it, it to does. subscribe to the it's channel. It's free. It's free, but then you get notified about new videos so you don't have to keep All looking. it costs is your dignity when people realise you've subscribed to our channel. Why dignity? <laughs> I don't know. Just trying to be funny. No. It don't work. Sometimes like you throw and the, subscribe. You throw That's these jokes say, out sometimes it? and they don't always work. Do yeah. They? Right. And it's free. Anyway, see you in the next video. Got some interesting trips coming up. Uh, Ta-da. Sit there. <laughs> Sit there.